welcome back to the channel we are looking at the stock price of lord's town motors cop with the ticker symbol r-i-d-e right so uh, today the stock is up 54 percent and rising uh 54 percent and trading at two dollars 32 cents so previously the stock closed at one dollar 51 cents and uh today it opened at one dollar 85 cents and during the course of the day it has risen all the way up to two dollars 32 cents as we speak today's range has been one dollar 59 cents all the way up to two dollars 39 cents 52 week range $1.50 all the way up to $15.80 so we are very close to the uh, bottom end of the 52 week range today's volume you have 75 million shares that have exchanged hands compared to an average volume of 6.5 million shares now the big news about Lordstown models is that um Fisca has announced that Foxconn will be building its second EV at the Lordstown uh, automobile plant, which is in Ohio. And uh, I believe that's the major news that caused uh, the stock price of Lordstown Motors Corporation to rise 53 to 54% today. Uh, this is quite unusual because if you look at the top of your screen, you can see that uh, the major indices are all trending downward. You have S&P S &P 500 going down, uh, Dow 30 in the red and trending downward, NASDAQ uh, in the red and trending downward, the Russell 2000 seems to be neutral and running close to a 1 percentage point gain. Crude oil is up. 0.15 percent trading at 105 dollars 87 cents so uh, lordstown motors corporation is an automotive company which designs and manufactures light duty electric trucks targeted for sale to fleet customers the firm develops and its flagship vehicle the endurance an electric full-size pickup truck the company was founded by Stephen S. Burns on November 13, 2018 and is headquartered in Lordstown, Ohio. The listed name for RIDE is Lordstown Motors Corporation Class A Common Stock. And the company has 632 employees. So that's the story uh, behind the rise of the value of lordstown motors corp in the stock market today so the company will be building vehicles uh, for foxconn uh, and i don't know if fisca is the designer but uh, the two of them are working together on this new vehicle that will be produced by lordstown motors now uh, foxconn as you guys might remember they are a major major subcontractor to apple and uh, they make a lot of uh, Apple I, uh, devices and uh, they're based, I think, out of uh, China, Taiwan. I'm not sure, <laughs> but they're in Southeast Asia and uh, that's what they do. And they have uh, the heft to actually get things done because they do it for Apple for millions and millions of devices sold worldwide. And uh, so if they are deciding to start producing an electric vehicle, I'm not sure if this is going to be an Apple product, <laughs> but Foxconn is, uh, they have one of their major clients as uh, with Apple, and we don't know yet what this vehicle is going to look like, uh, how much it's going to retail for, and how far they've gone with uh, the design and uh, the, the design and production process. But we'll keep our eyes peeled on this deal and see where this leads to. Uh, with the global uncertainty and uh, the energy markets in turmoil, it's always welcome to have another player in the EV sector because that's where uh, President Joe Biden is taking uh, the U.S. economy. And I think it's a very good deal and uh, it should work out well for investors in Lordstown models and others who are working towards developing the uh, recharging infrastructure up and down the United States. Thanks for joining me. Um, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button below, subscribe to the channel, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Bye.